Hi, this is your instructor, Julia Grav, again. We are going to calculate the net, the balance, the average cost per month, and the percentage of income here in this spreadsheet. The first thing I'm going to do, however, is increase the zoom here. So increase the scale so that you can see the numbers a little bit clearer, as well as the calculations. The net calculation here is essentially the same as in counting the expenses minus the income. Because we're paying a lot more in expenses in the first month, the net's going to change after the second. So let's go ahead and type in the expenses here. So we have our income minus our expenses. And then we're going to calculate our net after that point. So our income minus expenses for the remaining three months. Again, I'm just pulling that over. The balance is going to be a running tab of how much money you actually have. The first month we're in the rears, it's negative. The second month it's going to go up. So let's calculate that. So first we're going to start off with our net for uh, the first month and then add on the net value for the subsequent months. So here I'm using the point and click to add these two cells together. You could also use the sum function. So again, I'm taking the balance from last month and adding it the net of the current month to get a running tally of how much money I'll have at the end of the month. Next we're going to do an average cost per month. Basically we want to know the average expenses as a percentage of income. So again, the equal to sign. I'm going to use the average function here. So I'm going to type A, V, E, and then I'm going to select average using my down arrow, and then I'm going to hit tab on my keyboard to select that function. And so now we're looking at an average of all of the expenses. So that's the range B17 to E17, press enter. That's an average of the costs per month. Finally, we're going we're gonna to find out how much that is as a percentage of income. We'll take the average divided by our income, which is the same every month, right? It's uh, 25.50, and we'll just select cell B7 here as our denominator. Press enter. And let's just format this into a percentage. Up next, we're going to format this spreadsheet um, so that it's a lot easier to read and understand. Um, and I'll give you a preview of what that looks, off, looks like at the beginning of the next video.